today I'm going to read the Bible story. Yes. The top uh, the name of this chapter thirteen. Jesus walked on water. Mark eight nine mark six sorry for this. And you are going to do I am going to revise before I read. Yes, yesterday we have read 12th chapter, A Boy shell Shared His Lunch, Matthew 4. One boy was there and he was going to listen to Jesus' stories. And they were hungry, so, but they have no food. But that boy, little boy had the food, so he have given to the Jesus. He and Jesus didn't eat and broke the <laughs> broke the bread into half and prayed to Jesus and God. And they were they have eaten and twelve basket full of the things were left. Yes. Yeah. So, and today we are going to read 13 chapter. Jesus walked on water. Mark 6. Everybody had a hearty meal with five loaves of bread and two fish. Jesus told his disciple to go on a heat of a Head of him. He also told the people, Go back home. Then Jesus went up a mountain to pray. Now Jesus was a little bit tired, I think. So he was going to um, pray to God. Pray to God. Because yeah, he was going to pray to God, and so he just was alone. That he just said, "Go first, then me. I will pray, and I will go. You can go first, okay?" The disciple got into the boat. They were going over the Bethsaida. Okay, remember this. They were going to Bethsaida. Hmm, why this is not working? Oh. <laughs> Just oh, there was a. They couldn't believe Jesus fed over five thousand people with only five loaves of bread and two fish. So they were very surprised with the miracle, miracle of Jesus, that Jesus has fed. 5,000 people with only with five lovers and two fish. And there's a question. Were Jesus' disciple? Where did Jesus' disciple? Uh, where did Jesus' disciple were going? Where they were going? Do you know actually this is one shirt? My friend, Al. 
Hello. <gasps> the color is changing. Changing. <laughs> Not came the wind swooshed, the waves slushed. The disciple rode the boat with all their strength. They were so tired that they were going to um the storm came and Jesus disciples were also Getting tired to row, row, but um, Jesus' disciple were rowing very with their strength because if the storm came, um, they will die, na. Yeah, the answer were bad. Bisada, Bisada, Sada. The wave became stronger. The disciple couldn't row the boat. They became very weak. Suddenly, they stood, stopped rowing. Look at that! The disciple were afraid. Someone is walking on the water to us. So they were very. Like, oh, we are very tired. But they have, they couldn't row the boat anymore. They were too tired. And like, they stopped it. And look, what's that? Someone is walking on hot water. Who is that? Someone is walking on water. <clears throat> the disciples shouted, It's a ghost! It isn't. It is. It is I. Don't be afraid. It is me. Don't be afraid. The man on the water said, Jesus, shouted the disciple. When Jesus got in the boat, the wind climbed down. The disciples were very, even more surprised. Mm, actually, Jesus was more, the disciples were more surprised because like he was walking on the water that was very surprised but like when he have got in the boat they couldn't like row that much it was storming but if when he have got into the boat oh sorry wait a minute so like if they have sorry it was the phone call so like the when you have got into the boat they have stopped it yeah hmm. they were realized because Jesus was with them one disciple said who can do who can you just walk on water on the water a uh, how can how can you just walk on the water how can jesus make the wind climb it's because he is the son of god and other disciples said yes there is one more question today who said it's me don't be afraid Hmm, who have came on the boat? That is a big can. Yeah, one, two. The 
answer was Jesus. Yes, today I read the Bible story. Did you understand and enjoy? Then bye!